Hey guys, my name is Madison, and today I'm going to be showing you how to create a design or a sticker on PixArt. So I've recently started a Redbubble account, and I use PixArt in Canva to create my designs, but recently I've been using PixArt, so I'm going to show you how to do it. So at first, it's going to pop up with just this square with this dimensions. You can change the dimensions if you want to, but I usually just leave it at this. And right here is where you can upload your own images from your files and you can upload fonts. And here you have your templates. You can use these templates um, and just change them up if you like those. And here is the photos. Now, if you're creating a design for something like Redbubble, I would say just use stickers because most of the photos are for the premium payers and most of the stickers are free. So how I create my stickers for Redbubble is I use stickers and text. Now let's say I wanted to create an Outer Banks design. I'm just gonna do the one that I just created today since I already know what I'm doing. So on the first one, I'm just gonna click like that to type in outer, and then I'm gonna do the second one. Oops, thanks. And you can put something like a subtitle in the middle if you want to, like paradise on earth, because that's what I did on mine. And you can center them if you want to, or have them uncentered. And the cool thing about the text is you can click up here. Here's the text and font. Here you can change the color. Here you can, it's called stroke. And then this is for the shadow. You can duplicate the text or you can delete the text. So on the text, you can pick a different kind of font. Like you could pick that kind of font and do it on both of them. And this shows the recent fonts that you've used. So I'm going to do both of those that. And then here you can change the size. You can make it bigger, make it smaller. You can also make your lettering bold or not bold. You can make it italicized or underlined. And here you can space out your letters, which I think is cool. I like doing this sometimes. And you can change the line height, which just makes the text box bigger. And you can put it in caps, you can put it in lowercase, uppercase, all that stuff. You can align, center, write, justify. And then the thing I like using the best is the bend tool. It's where you can take your letters and bend them like this. Could do like that and then bend this the other oops the other way and then you have this in the middle so then that's how i do my text not all the time but those are my favorite tools that i like using and then for the stickers you could look up outer banks and they have all sorts of pictures Try not to pick pictures, like if you're making a design for Redbubble, try not to pick pictures that can get copyrighted. So I'll just do something like, like this design and you can edit your stickers and you can make it smaller and put it in this corner over here or wherever. And you can pick how many ever things you would like to put and just make it how you like to do it. And you can just do this until you feel like it's enough or you feel like it looks good enough for your liking. And then once you're done, I'm just going to actually put one more picture. You just click export and download. And as you can see down here, it'll download it onto your computer. And that's just about it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video and stay tuned for more.